Um, hey guys, Sam Blanche here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to customize your Windows 7 as in um, you start menus all different. Um, if I open the file, you can see all here is different, and that it basically changes nearly everything. Um, for this, what you're going to want to have is Windows blinds, which give me a sec. I want to go to Google quickly. For the, because if you're using Windows 7, you're going to want to have Windows Blinds 7.2. Shit, sorry. 7.2, um, which is this one here. Um, I'll put a uh, link in the description for this. Um, and what this is, it's basically this and it lets you change it all to, uh, change it and whatnot and for this one I'm going to be showing you the battlefield 3 theme um, and basically what to what to do to, uh, what to do to get it and download it so for starters you're going to want to uh, you're going to want to go on to here uh, wincustomize.com this I'll post a link in the description for the Battlefield Free theme, but if you wanted to find any other theme that you might like, you just go into the Explore area and go down to Windows Blinds. The main thing you gotta do is um, make sure it's compatible with your Windows, so applicable only with Windows 7, uh, Blinds 7, which basically means you have to have Windows Blinds 7 to use it, um, which Anyway, you have to if you have Windows 7 because Windows Minds 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 are incompatible up to Vista and not Windows 7 but 7, 7.2, 7.3 are. So this is where you get the Battlefield Free theme. You click here to download it. Once you download it, um, you're going to want to find a uh, Battlefield Free background to go with it, which I already have one. So I'm just going to go into pictures, going to go into wall, desktop wallpapers, going to right click and set this as desktop background for now. And then you're going to want to go into Windows theme. Mine's already installed. If yours isn't installed, as in the theme, you just go into skin options, install new, find out where have you downloaded it, which mine's in downloads, double click on it and it will install it. So once it's installed, you basically just find it on this little scrolly area install it, uh, I've got the uh, 30 day trial because this does cost but there is a way to uh, reset your trial which I'll post a link in the description to a video on YouTube that lets you do this so just click continue little Battlefield 3 uh, Battlefield 3 guy comes on and there you go, your desktop's changed. You've got the little animated frostbite 2 bit here, the animated desk, the uh, dice bit. Um, if you open, if you, your clock's orange and whatnot. Uh, yeah. Uh, sorry about that, guys, I had to go get uh, my lunch. But yeah, um, like I was saying, it changes the time, like, as in. It's got an orange tint to it. Um, you've got the image here that changes. The animated stuff here, the Battlefield 3 logo there. And when you open like Google Chrome for example, it changes the up top bit here. And that's basically what it does. But um, you can find loads of other cool themes and whatnot on uh, Win Customize. Some do cost. Some don't, and like I said, the program does cost. But there is a way to um, there is a way to keep resetting your 30 day trial. But to be honest, if you find a uh, one you like, you can just like keep it as that, and you, even when it runs out, you don't need to use it anymore. But um, yeah, guys, this is how you change your uh, Windows blinds bit to whatever you want and whatnot. So um, I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll talk to you later.